Ich begrüße euch zu einer neuen Folge von Life is Strange. Wir gehen jetzt in die Episode 2, denn wir haben die Geschichte, die Geschichte massiv verändert. Ähm, ja, wir wollten nur was Gutes tun und wollten dafür sorgen, dass äh, der Vater von Chloe nicht getötet wird durch den Autounfall und haben seine Schlüssel versteckt. Und ja, das Ende vom Lied war, wir waren wieder in der Zeit, es hat sich einiges verändert. Ähm, wie vor allem, dass Chloe jetzt im Rollstuhl sitzt und ich bin sehr gespannt, wie das jetzt hier weitergeht. Äh, alles hat sich ein bisschen geändert. Victoria ist nett zu mir, Warren redet nicht wirklich mit mir. Äh, von daher, ich bin sehr gespannt und deswegen gehen wir direkt rein. Los geht's. Previously on Life is Strange. You don't know who the fuck I am or who you're messing around with. Don't you ever touch me again, freak! Let's talk about your superpower. What are you doing here, Max? Stop! Don't come near me! Not now. It won't work. I know this isn't pleasant for any of us. Miss Coffee, please, tell us everything. Hey, Selma and Louise. That's Rachel's bracelet. Why the fuck are you wearing her bracelet? Calm yourself, all right? It was a gift. Next, we have to find Rachel soon. Like you said, it's time to start the search for clues. Welcome to my domain. Let's find what we want and beat it. Max, we better come check out these files. Rachel in the dark room. Over and over. That's it. What is this? I found the pictures of Rachel and Frank. Be more than a friend. I can't, I can't believe, believe she was banging, banging Frank. Frank. Rachel straight, straight up lied, lied to my, my face. face. Why didn't she, she say anything? anything? So who do you most want to blame? My fucking dad, of course. Hello? No, you don't. Do you know what it's like to wait for your father to come home when you're a kid? Ever since he died, my life has been dipped in shit. Chloe, I am awesome. We are awesome. Hello? Are you even listening, Maxine? This is totally fucked up. What else have I changed? Max Caulfield. Hold on. Chloe, you have a visitor. Hm, das ist so in der Kurzform alles passiert. Ganz schön heftig. Okay, ich bin am Strand. Okay, es sind richtig viele Wale. Jetzt zu sagen, es wäre nicht meine Schuld, wäre ein bisschen falsch, oder? Life is Strange, Episode 4, Dark Room. It's weird hanging out with you again. 
I know. I'm glad we are, though. It was nice that you sent me actual letters. It's more than any of my other friends have done. And you even wrote on that cool parchment paper. It's so Max. So pretentious. But I love writing on it like an English poet. You deserve the best stationery. Probably easier to write than to visit me. I don't mean that in a bitchy way. Not totally. You probably wanted to avoid awkward conversations like this. Uh, pretty much, yeah. Look, the worst thing you can do is treat me like a baby. I still want to laugh and talk shit with my best friend. Can we stop? This is seriously the best view of the sunset. What do photographers call that? The golden hour. See? Without you here, I have no clue. Bet you could take some amazing shots. Those beach whales are so sad. I kind of know how they feel. At least, I'm alive here with you. You're a real survivor, Chloe. I know you have to deal with so much. I don't want anybody else feeling sorry for me. I can do that. Along with my parents. My dad still feels guilty about buying me that car. Are you okay to talk about the accident? We never actually have, huh? There's not much to say. Some prick in an SUV cut me off and I flew into a ditch. Do you remember everything? I saw everything in bullet time. I felt my back snap and... And that was the last thing I ever felt in my body. When I woke up in the hospital, I literally couldn't move a muscle. Jesus. I, I, I don't know what to say. Don't say anything. I'm just happy I did get to see you again. I could have ended up vanishing out of the blue like that girl from Blackwell. What, what missing girl? I don't know her name. I just read about it in the news. I feel bad for her family. This is such a different world than when we were kids, isn't it? After that snow and eclipse, it's more like the end of the world. It might be, but... I'd like to think we can still change things for the better. I'd like to think that too. But I don't have much hope these days. I know things seem out of control, but... As long as we're together, I don't feel afraid. Hanging out with you makes me feel like a total kid again. You don't even know. Listen, Chloe. I'm sorry I haven't been out to see you more. That was wrong. You're my best friend. Max. Thanks for coming out to see me. You're, you're doing awesome. I don't think so. Um, my, my nose is getting cold. Maybe we should go back to my place? It is hella cold out here. Hella? I hate that word, no offense. None taken. Der Leuchtturm wieder. Man weiß auch gar nicht, was man dazu sagen soll. Also es ist so ein bisschen, äh, bin ich noch geschockt. Ein wenig geplättet. Pretty high-tech lair. Feels like a high-tech cell. But I am lucky my parents bust their ass to take care of me. I know it's hard for them. They're grateful you are here with them. Right. 
Especially when they can't even take a walk alone. Sometimes I act like a total teenage brat just to give them an excuse to yell at me. Pathetic, you know. Chloe, you're a great daughter. You're kind and sensitive. But when you don't even have to be. Trust me, I still get my rage on. Especially when a nurse has to watch while I take a gump so she can wipe my bum. Or when doctors flip me around like I was a science doll. I can't even imagine. But you're still amazing. You always have been since we were kids. Thanks again for coming, Max. I, uh, <clears throat> need to get my drink on. Uh, can you, can you bring me some water? So, jetzt haben wir mal ein bisschen, können wir das selber machen. So sieht es in Chloes Zimmer in der zweiten Zeit aus. Da ist ein Becher. Drink up, Buttercup. Oh man. No wonder my throat is dry. I don't think I talked this much the whole year. Have you ever thought about doing a podcast or something? I wish I could punch your face right now. A podcast? Dude, I am a pod in a cast. Boring. Ouch. It was just a thought. I know you're just trying to help. <sighs> yeah, that's become a bad habit of mine. You sound like an adult now. It seems like we were kids in another life. To me, it, it seems like yesterday we were little brats here. Watching Power Rangers and destroying the kitchen. Oh my god, we covered everything in flour, <laughs> even my parents. That was so hilarious. <sighs> but a long time ago. You're the only person that I grew up with who visits me. As you can see, I can't keep all my other friends away. You have me. I'm not leaving you, Chloe. Well, you didn't visit me a lot either. I mean, I loved your cards and photos, but... I know I wasn't around much. No excuses, I'm a loser. But I am trying to make things right. How? Dude, you're not super max. And I'm not trying to guilt trip you. That's what my parents are for. I know this is a dumb question, but... Are you lonely here? Yes, dumb question. I don't mind being alone. I can't exactly go party like a rock star, though. Or get in any teen trouble with the folks. I think Joyce and William are incredible. Max, the accident has been so hard on them. Our insurance sucks and the medical bills are fucking insane. I bet. This tech must be crazy expensive. Along with the drugs, the nurses, the supplies. Mom and Dad are always broke, and they get so frustrated. Is it worth it? Chloe, you're priceless. Uh, no pun intended. <laughs> you are such a geek. That's why I love you. Of course, I know a geek when I be one. See, I'm practically a human entertainment system. It would be sweet to chill out together and watch a movie like when you'd spend the night at my house. What do you want to watch? Uh, I think I'm in like a, a mellow Blade Runner mood. I always cry at the end. Plus, you know, I always wanted to have cool colored bangs like Chris. I know. You would look incredible with blue hair. Now let's get this show on the road. And you better not fall asleep on me like you always do when you watch movies. I remember, Max. I swear I won't fall asleep. Not when you're here. Not yet. Also stellen wir mal den Fernseher ein und färben mir die Haare. Oh, the snow dough. I guess not everything changed. Oh my god, I made that mix for her when we were 12. Piraten an die Macht. Here's the DVD. Ich fühle mich irgendwie schuldig.
I cannot believe you fell asleep so fast. How dare you. I know you were beat down after the day with me. And Blade Runner is a pretty dreamy movie to watch at night. Uh, do, you, do you think Deckard is a replicant? Sorry, I can see you're not wide awake like me. No, I'm sorry I crashed so hard. Were you okay? I do have a mother and father when you're not falling asleep on me. You are a bitch in the morning. It's the company I keep. Yesterday was such a blast. It was great seeing you. I know things were different when we were just dorky kids, but being with you made me feel like when we were little pirates jumping and running through the forests again. It meant a lot to me just to chill out with you and, and bullshit. <sighs> Fuck. Um, I'm getting my regular head pains. Uh, can you, pretty please, go upstairs and get my, my morphine injector in the bathroom? No clock. Morphine injector? It's, uh, it's total Star Trek shit. You can't even see the needle. Seriously, I, I need it. Um, my parents keep the swag upstairs because they think I can't get to it. But you can, Max. Like a pirate, right? I'm on it, Chloe. As I'm bad. Man, Joyce and William built a whole new bathroom for Chloe. They're so great. And she comes in. It's nice my parents sent a card at least. I wonder who this is. Kind of a generic card. Hmm. Megan, okay. I wasn't very available to Chloe. Real nice. Dann nur kurz schreiben, damit du weißt, dass ich an dich denke. Ich komme mir wie eine Müllfrau, wenn ich sowas wie. Ich weiß, dass dein Leben ist jetzt anders und ich möchte nicht, dass das unsere Freundschaft im Weg steht. Ja, ich war eine Weile nicht in der Nähe, aber das ändert sich bald. At least I sent road trip selfies to Chloe. I'm sure that made her feel great. So, also, wir sind ins Bad. Aber ich komme hier nicht rein. Hey, William. Um, am I bothering you? Why, yes, Max. I love going through bills. <laughs> Kidding. How can you bother me? I haven't seen you in forever. I know. You look exactly the same. <laughs> it's so cool. Good. Or I'd be scared if I didn't look like me. <laughs> of course, you seem more adult now. So what's on your mind? I don't know how to say this, but I'm truly sorry about what happened to Chloe. Me too. All it takes is a few minutes to change a girl's whole life. But she's alive. She's been a trooper. She's amazing. I'm so glad you're here to help her. And be her father. I'm so glad Joyce is here to help us both. Max, I... I just hate to think of what would happen to Chloe if I wasn't here. William, I just want you to know that whatever happens, I'll always be here for Chloe. Always. I know you will, Max. Okay. I was impressed by Chloe's room and all the high-tech equipment. You should be. We could buy a few mansions for what it all costs. The insurance helps, but... Uh, I don't know, Max. I know it must be hard on you guys, financially. These bills are more like crushing. We have to mortgage our home, and that's pretty scary. <laughs> but we'll get through it. Price is always right. Get it? No? So, could you... I have to go see if Chloe needs anything. It was so great talking with you again. <laughs> you act like it's the last time. And please keep me from these bills whenever you want. Oh, we have from Victoria Post. Come heute Abend in meinem Zimmer. Max, alles cool. Ich wollte nur sicher gehen, weil du vorhin so schnell abgehauen wirst. Nathan macht sich auch Sorgen. Wenn du reden willst, melde dich. Okay, hab dich lieb. Wenn du sauber bist, sag's mal einfach. Okay, Funkstelle. Wenn du reden willst, meine Tür steht offen. Hab dich lieb. Warum ist sie so nett? Oh, Chloe. 
Ich besuche dich bald. Okay. Taylor? Ich glaube, das nicht. Es ist okay zu ein. Was hat sie hier denn? Okay. Ruf mich zurück. Nathan. In der Dunkelkammer. Entwickle Fotos für den Wettbewerb. Also kein Two Ways für dich. Noch nicht. Ich sehe euch später. Peace. Was ist denn hier passiert? Ich brauche. Ich habe nur Filme gekauft. Keine Kamera. Oh, die haben ja Streit. Herzlichen Glückwunsch. Der Mutter hier, wir müssen über einige deiner Rechnungen reden. Bist du da? Ja, gib mir etwas Zeit an, weil ich kann nicht im Unterricht texten. Eigentlich wir werden mega pissig, wenn man sein Handy rausholt. Ja, weil das ist extrem unhöflich ist und sei nicht so zickig zu mir. Entschuldige, langer Tag mit Hausaufgaben. Du bist nicht die Einzige, deswegen haben wir uns gefragt, ob du so viel ausgeben musst. Wir möchten, dass es dir an nichts fehlt, aber dein Spenden deckt nicht alles ab. Du hast gesagt, ich könnte deine Kreditkarte benutzen, wenn ich sie brauche. Ich habe noch Filme gekauft, keine Kamera. Vielleicht wird es Zeit, auf digital umzusteigen. Ich rufe dich später an, muss los. Schmoll nicht, ich liebe dich. Hey Liebling, ich hoffe, du lässt deine Pflanze nicht verdursten. Aber er drängt sie auch nicht. Hier hat sich ja auch alles verändert. Hey Max, es ist ein, dass du mit diesen Leuten herumhängst. Ich dachte, du wärst anders. Ich habe gesehen, wie du Klopapier nach mir geworfen hast. Ich habe so noch nicht auf dich gezählt, ich schwöre. Tu es nie wieder. Okay, was, was hat der Vater geschrieben? Hm, nix. So, wir sollen ja hier ins Bad. Wir ah, sind Rechnungen. Okay. Also ich weiß, oben ist das Bad. Gucken. Und zwar hier hinten. So, erstmal Lichter machen. So, jetzt muss man... Hier ist noch ein Schrank. Ah, nichts. So, jetzt gehen wir mal runter. Was ist jetzt hier? Oh, komplett leer. I guess we stop growing up together. Hm. Schön ein bisschen deprimierend. At least we never had to hide from step douche. Toys? I kind of want to open this and see what's in here. They bought crutches for Chloe. So, da gab es einen kleinen kurzen Cut. So, hier hinten ist noch ein Brief und dann gehen wir gleich runter zu Chloe. Danke, dass du mich auf dem Laufenden hältst, was Chloe ist zuschauen. Also ich kann mir die Mühen, die du und wem durchleben, kaum vorstellen. Es tut mir so leid, dass ich momentan nicht mit Geld aushelfen kann. Wie jeder, jeder andere gehe ich in meinen eigenen Arztrechnung unter. Okay. So, jetzt wollen wir auch mal zu Chloe gehen. Immerhin kriegt sie ja Kopfschmerzen. Das 
stop me if I'm being too emo, but can you grab one of the photo albums over there? I'd like to check out some old pictures of us when we were kids. Please, my diary is like emo ground zero. Plus, Max Caulfield does not pass up a photo op with Chloe Price. Ever. So, also, irgendwo soll hier noch ein Foto sein? Na, hier. Is that okay? Perfect. Oh my god. Look how little we are there. We look like toys. I remember that day by the lighthouse. My dad just pissed at us. He actually tried to give us a time out. We laughed at him. My dad would have vanished. Side to umblätter. Wow, awesome picture. We look so badass in our pirate gear. We should have taken over Arcadia Bay when we had the chance. There's still time for you. Oh man, there we are making pancakes. I love that shot of us. It's hard to believe my dad took that picture of no, was you believe, it Literally seems like yesterday. I wish it was. Me too. This photo... Maybe I could... Listen, Max. My respiratory system is failing, and... Uh, and it's only getting worse. I've heard the doctors talking about it when they thought I was locked out. So... I know I'm just putting off the inevitable while my parents suffer along, and I will too. This isn't how I want things to end. What? What are you saying? I'm saying that being with you again has been so special. I just wanted to feel like when we were kids running around Arcadia Bay and everything was possible, and you made me feel that way today. I want this time with you to be my last memory. Do you understand? Yes, I do. All you have to do is crank up the IV to 11. Oh my god. Was tue ich? Ich akzeptiere es. Aktive Sterbehilfe. Chloe, I'll just drift to sleep. Dreaming of us here together. Forever. Thank you so much. I'm so proud of you for following your dreams. Don't forget about me. Never. I love you, Max. See you around. Sooner than you think. Uh, yeah. habe ich schon zwei auf dem Gewissen. Ähm, ja. Ich würde sagen, ich mache einfach ein Cut. Trauriger geht es, glaube ich, denke ich nicht. Ähm, von daher... Auch das muss erstmal verordnen. Ich, wir, wir sehen uns in der nächsten Folge. Dann versuchen wir in die Vergangenheit zurückzureißen. Mal gucken, ob wir was ändern können nochmal. Ähm, 
Bis dahin sage ich euch vielen Dank fürs Zuschauen und wir sehen uns bald. Wie hättet ihr entschieden? Schreibt es einfach in die Kommentare, lasst ein Feed da und wir sehen uns in der nächsten Folge. Ich bin gespannt, ob wir vielleicht doch alles noch zum Guten wenden können. Erinnert uns, das ganze Spiel erinnert mich immer mehr an den Film und ähm, naja, gut. Wir sehen uns, bis dahin, ich wünsche euch was.